Morning guys. And um, it's just, just a follow up really from my appeal. Uh, three weeks ago I asked and I've had 65 of you. Well, um, I've had some harrowing conversations. Many of you feel like you're on your own. Please don't feel like you're on your own. You're not, you're not. Let me tell you, there are more of you than you realize. And one voice, 10 voices, 15 voices, 20, 30, 40, 50, we're up to 65 now. So many of you girls have told me that you've got colleagues who are desperate to speak out, but are too frightened. Just ring up John O'Looney, see what he says. Hello, yeah, it's um. Have you ever heard of Mark Sexton? He's your mate, isn't he? Yes, he is. Yeah. He's got a book out, hasn't he? Yeah. Yeah, it's a, it's a made up like it's just fantasy book, right? It's not even true what he's talking in the. It's called um elimination or something, isn't it? I haven't read it, so I couldn't tell you. Uh, recently, he was at a Bristol centre, and he's got it shut down, apparently, right? That's, that's right, yeah, they shut one down, yeah. It was bollocks, I just rang him up. <laughs> they are not shut. I really don't know. I can only say the same as you, um, based on what I see. I can go there, I can go there today and get a... They're open at 11 a fucking clock. <laughs> Till 6.30. Six I, six I, really I really don't know. I really don't know. Perhaps you should go down there and film it and make a video and release that video. i got better things to fucking do. It's just, I'm just pointing, I just rang them up. It's fucking bollocks. It's not been shut down. Well, I'm just telling you. I'm telling okay. you. You get you. You put it out there. You fucking speak to people. You can say you've got it from good source that the fucking is still fucking thriving. Maybe it is all still going. I really don't know. Not being down there, I don't know. Why they? Yeah, they might be trying, but they told. They told the people. That they've shot it and they haven't. Well, I'll tell Mark as soon as you hang up. I'll speak to Mark and tell him. And another fucking thing: this Mark Sexton's been going round fucking old bill shops for fucking ages, and he ain't done jack shit. What's he been doing? He goes round cop shops, don't he? Fucking with bits of paper, saying that they're gonna fucking do this, and nothing's fucking happening. It's a load of bollocks. Well, I'm He's gonna trouble it. Well, he's flogging books as well. I mean, what the fuck? Ain't he got a proper job? Or is that his fucking job? Is that his fucking... Never trust a fucking ex-copper. Right? Right? And the fucking ex-BBC. They're a bunch of cunts as well. Of course they are. Ex-coppers? I won't fucking... Do you trust fucking ex-coppers? Because I don't. They're scumbags. They're fucking scumbags. Always a copper. Once a copper, always a fucking copper. It's anyway. Eh? Happens, it? But I can tell you, um, when he pulled me out of hospital, if he hadn't come and got me, he'd have done me. Well, that's another fucking story, isn't it? But I tell you what, he goes round the fucking cop shops with his bit of fucking paper and he's achieved absolutely fuck all, right? Fuck all that bloke's achieved. He goes round making out he's fucking this, that and the next and he's fucking doing this and that. He well, just I as think, well uh, at the very least, he must have raised a lot of awareness. Raised a lot of fucking money.
That's uh, about all he's I'm fucking I'm raised, I'm eh? I don't want to speak to him. Ex fucking old Bill. He probably sent him around a fucking squat team. So you say he wrote a book, did he? Yeah, 1699 on Amazon if you want to read it. It's fucking made up fiction about a fucking copper or something. About a what? A copper? Oh, okay. No, I've never heard of that. I've never heard of that. Yeah, they all make fucking money out of it, innit? Out of the fucking public's misery, right? This is what it's all about. There's no fucking hope. Right? And looking at these people is a waste of fucking time. And why I'm angry, why, why I'm angry is because it fucks me off. It's fucking stupid. you got all these truthers looking to these people for the fucking what to do. And these people, they know there's fuck all you can do about it. There's nothing you can do to stop this. No, perhaps we'll just roll over all night. No, you just get on with your fucking life, don't you, and do your best. Well, I think that's all, all of us. We're trying to care, to be honest with you. Yeah, but it's just fiction to think that you can fucking change any of this. <laughs> it's been well, going on for fucking it's generations, it's man. It's eh? all about people, isn't it? If enough people say no, they ain't going to be able to do it. That's the bottom line. Well, they never fucking will do that, do they? They're too fucking propagated. Well, I can fucking tell you, man, I must be a fuck. I can read the fucking into the future because I know nothing's ever fucking happened and it never fucking will. Nothing lasts forever, though, does it? Yeah, it well, it won't. They'll just depopulate the fucking people through propaganda and then, and then off we fucking go for the next fucking million years. That's all it'll be and the people will fucking get on with it. That's what they do. There's no backbone. I fucking ain't. I know how it is. It's fucking true. There's no hope for this fucking to change any of this around. And anyone who thinks that is fucking delusional. For fuck's sake. Listen, dude, I've got to go. I've got a phone call coming for you. Take care. Yeah.